Thank you for joining us. First at five, police departments all over the country are facing a crisis of officer shortages and budget cuts. Uh, today, a subcommittee on Capitol Hill started exploring those issues as part of National Police Week. 7 News reporter Brianna Smith standing by with us in the studio tonight because, Brianna, there is a specific upstate connection to this. Yeah, it was really interesting. Today, Spartanburg Police Chief Alonzo Thompson was asked by Congressman Trey Gowdy to actually speak about these issues alongside heads from Los Angeles, Houston, and the Fraternal Order of Police. Now, this was in D.C. for the subcommittee hearing on crime, terrorism, and homeland security. Chief Thompson said there are three main issues that face uh, that are facing his department, including community police relations, recruitment and retention of officers, and also big budget deficiencies. Thompson stated that many issues also come from the growing need for technology in these departments, including the cost of storing the hundreds of thousands of hours of body camera video they get each year. Thompson also focused on their response to mental health needs in our community. We're finding more and more uh, situations where the actions, although they may appear to be criminal in nature, would be better served if we were to, defer, to defer or get the people to the type of help that they need. You know, also very interesting today, um, Congressman uh, Trey Gowdy mentioning about uh, Officer Alan Jacobs and also Officer Jason Harris, who we've lost sure. in the past year in our community. And this is National Police Week. So it's really focusing on the service they gave and the service they need in the coming Look, years. We've been over some of these issues a hundred times on the local level, and it seems like community relations is related to the officer shortage, which is related to the budget shortfall. So is the answer going to be coming out of Congress just more money? I think they need more money because that also relates back to the training. Training that officers get, hiring those quality people, and making sure they're ready for any situation on the road. All right, Brianna.